Alrighty guys, we're back with another video. This one has been requested from a subscriber. They've been asking for me to review the Disco Dome and it's been a few months. So, so I'm happy that I can finally do a review on this unit. It's been a while. I rented it out last weekend, so we're gonna inflate it. Well, we got it inflated already. So we're gonna go inside and give you guys a review of, on this unit. It's a really good one, so make sure you stay tuned and listen. This might be an inflatable you wanna add to your inventory. So with that said, guys, let's go check it out inside. It is all black inside. It's pretty cool. Uh, right now, I don't have the door covered. Uh, it does come with the cover on here. So uh, yeah, so the first thing I'm gonna show you guys is gonna be show you guys the inside. The disco ball goes connected right here. And um, so what I had to do was run an extension cord to the top, and uh, the extension plug is inside there. That's where I connect the, the light that comes with this unit. The light is worth about 45 bucks. You can get it on Amazon. This little hole here is where the speaker goes. The speaker you do have to buy separately yourself. And check out the bouncing area, guys. It's neon. Sorry for all the mess. We're actually about to clean it. Um, so the inside is pretty cool. All these bright colors. Looks really nice inside. Let me take you guys to the outside. And we're actually cleaning other units right now. There's our pink combo water slide. I might review this one in the same video, but... So here's the disco dome from the outside, guys. Again, the cover is not on it yet. Let me show you guys the speaker that I purchased for it. So guys, this is the speaker that I bought. Um, it's where did I get this one? I think I got this one at Best Buy for like 80 bucks. Uh, it's pretty cool, pretty durable. It's a charger. It's a chargeable, portable speaker. So you charge it up. Let's go put it where it goes. So this speaker goes in here. And you can put it in through the put it in through the outside or the inside so that speaker goes right there and it does stay in place if you're jumping it stays in there um, it, it, it does have it does have rubber all around I think that's what helps it stay in place and if it were to lean on this the velcro kind of holds it So this is what it looks like fully covered guys i just threw it up on there it does have an alligator clip uh, so it could stay secure but um, i just threw it over just for the review real quick so for this one guys it does get it is going to need two cords this one's the one that runs up for the for the speaker and then you do need the one for the blower so two extension cords for this unit two different plugs i'm gonna plug in the the light inside right now this goes light that it comes with guys it comes with a USB it comes with a USB with some music in there but um it's funny because the music that it comes with this is made in China the music that it comes with actually says cuss words I actually ended up uh, listening to it and it's supposed to be for kids, so watch out if you do get this light on Amazon. 
they provide it with you when you buy the disco dome um so inside of the disco dome it doesn't have the harness to connect this disco ball uh so again guys this unit was made from unique world and poorly designed to with the detail i know you guys have heard me talk bad about unique world but honestly they need to pay more attention to the detail so i had to do this i had to wrap it around and when i go plug it in inside i have to also loop this with that other extension cord and it stays hanging like this and it just wobbles like it should be able to stay in place but i'll show you guys what it, what i'm talking about right now i'm gonna go go install it so i'm inside the unit right now guys i got the flash on and this is where you have to connect it they should have added like a little some little clips there to be able to hold the light in place and every time unless i'm doing this wrong guys but there's the extension cord it's a tiny little hole and it's hot in here so i have the unit turned off so i can reach it because you do have to take this light out every single time that you rent it out i've gone through three of these lights because they i try to leave it inside and they end up breaking all right so let me just grab this look how tight it is my fingers barely fit in there so i grab this cord and i'll show you guys what i'm talking about all right guys so there's the loop that i'm talking about you have to twist the cords and look at all this slack that it has and this just wobbles in here unless i'm doing it wrong guys i'm not sure if you have this unit leave me a comment below if i'm doing this wrong but honestly they never showed me how it was supposed to go that's just how i do it now let's make sure it doesn't have a no on button so let's go plug it in it's hot I stepped in here and the light turned off. Huh. Maybe it got unplugged, hopefully. So this unit guys it is very time consuming to install the light get the speaker going it's not even there anymore i think it fell out uh, so i connected the light turned on the inflatable and as soon as it went all the way uh once it was fully inflated the light turned off uh so i'm not sure what happened maybe it got unplugged right here i'm gonna check it out right now So we got the light plugged in guys. Um, so this speaker actually connects to Bluetooth. I forgot to mention that. I provide the bigger speaker because this thing is not loud enough. So this unit guys, I bought it again from Unique World. It was $3,000. Um, I'm not sure if, I think $29.95. And I'm not sure if other people get them for better deals, but that's what I got mine for. Uh, this unit, when I first got it, I rented it out for $300, no problem. That's the reason I ordered it, because I had a customer, I had a customer special request this unit. Uh, so that's the reason I purchased it, rented it to her, 300. Um, and then we had it listed on the website. Uh, it went out one more time for $300. And after that, a lot of people were interested in it, but they weren't willing to pay that amount. So we lowered the price down to 250. Uh, 250 was a good price point. Uh, I ended up contacting the first customer and I gave her a $50 credit because I didn't think it was fair that she paid uh, more than what I was charging now since I lowered the price. That's just something I did on my part because um, I honestly, I wouldn't like to see that that they overcharged me and then they lowered their price later on. So that's why I went ahead and gave her a $50 credit for her next order. So overall guys, is this a unit that I recommend to purchase? It is a very cool, unique unit. You are gonna be spending a lot of money, $3,000.
there's not a, a little bit of cash, you know what I mean? Uh, you do get to rent it for a lot more. Uh, you know, so it's up to you guys. If you want to add three more regular units that rent out for a hundred bucks, because those are about a thousand bucks each. Or if you want to add this disco dome, if you have three thousand dollars and you just want to add one unit, you know, that's really up to you guys what you think is going to be the best move for your business. But if you rather have this one make you more money, you know, uh, I definitely recommend it. If you have a lot of other units and this is something you're looking to add to your inventory, I definitely recommend it. This is definitely not a unit that I would recommend starting off with or a unit that you want to add if you only have a few inflatables. I definitely wait until you have a variety of uh, regular jumpers, combos, and then possibly add this one. But, you know, who am I? to know maybe you have better luck with your unit than i do this unit has only gone out to me uh, out for me within a year it only went out about it only went out about 10 times so i made my money back and uh so for me guys this, so for me guys this for, so for me guys this unit uh only goes out about once or twice a month um uh, maybe I need to add more pictures and some videos to my website. There's not a lot of detail of what this unit is on my website. It's just a picture of it from the outside. And I think a lot of people probably don't get the idea of what it is. So I'm um, definitely going to be adding a lot more pictures, some video clips so they can see what it's about. Um, if you could find this unit made by another manufacturer around the same price, I would probably buy it from them. Uh, just because all those minor details that I told you guys about um it makes a big difference if, unless unique well actually you can make special requests um so you guys are actually lucky if you purchase this unit after you watch this review because these are the things that you can ask for when you go and purchase it one of the things that you want to ask for is going to be it's going to be ordering this i would go with both blue the yellow let, lets way too much light go through all right another thing that you could request is uh so either so a little strap you need a strap an alligator clip and a strap so that way you can connect the speaker and it's secured up there now for this part this will hold it this will hold the speaker for the most part right it'll just bounce back and over but either ordering a strap to be able to secure this a strap to be able to secure this from one side to the other and then maybe back or back across so it stays in place uh, so that's a few things you could ask for other than that guys i think that's pretty much it everything else is well designed um as you can see i'm sweating in here it is hot. It's not a unit that I would recommend you guys using uh, in the middle of the day. It's definitely more of an evening thing, a nighttime party. Um, so at night when it's really dark, these lights look a lot better. It's really cool, really nice design. It's a unique inflatable, guys. This is definitely a cool one to add to your inventory. Alrighty guys, well that's pretty much it for this review. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure you leave a like and a comment. That really helps out the video so they get recommended to other people. So if you're not subscribed, make sure you subscribe. And if you're interested in seeing other reviews and you got a unit that you wanna see, let me know, leave a comment down below and I'll be making a review of it pretty soon. Until next video guys, peace.